guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you all loved the last video and thank you for joining me again. Today I'm going to be looking through my gym bag. It's an absolute mess in there, but I'm one of them people who just, I know where everything is in there. So let's take a look inside the bag. Okay, this is my bag I use for gym every day. It literally has absolutely everything in it. Um, yeah, so I'm just going to get started and show you guys. Okay, so first I have this little pouch bag and it holds many things. My straps for gloves and, gloves and loops, my gloves, uh, my wristbands. And I also do this thing like for stamina on bars. And basically this is a, it's called an occlusion cuff. And you basically put it around your arm like this, tighten it up, pump some air into it so your arms kind of go dead a little bit. And then you do lovely stamina sets with it on and it's really, really fun and really, really painful. <laughs> it's not fun at all. Um, but it's a good way for me to kind of get bar stamina in without doing constant routines and oh, and then this is the pump you plug it in and then pump it up like that okay so that's the first thing i mean there's a lot of things in here like too much it literally holds like my whole life so that's my strap bag um multiple pairs of shorts just in case we ever get to gym we don't have a pair of shorts that would be criminal Okay, next thing is my pineapples. Literally, can't do vault without these. I think I have a few pairs in here. Um, but yeah, these are the ones I'm currently in right now, and then I just keep spares in my bag. And then the multiple elastics for rehab, conditioning. Literally, oh my gosh, <laughs> I told you it was a mess. It's not organised at all. So I have a red skinny one, a red stretchy one. A yellow one and a thicker blue one and I'm, I'm mainly using these in the minute for my rehab oh I also have a green one uh yeah mainly using these for my rehab at the minute um I guess the less you use elastics the better because it means you're not doing as much rehab and I'm not using them as much anymore which is a good sign um so yeah that's all my elastics I mean got enough for, for the whole squad at the gym pretty much Okay, and these are my wristbands that I wear on my feet, literally on every piece. Bars, in case I hit a heel, so my heels are protected. Beam, because I do a lot of heavy impacts, again, to protect my heels. And floor and vault, really, just because, I, I don't really know, but, yeah, I guess they just stay on my feet the whole session, so I can't really do anything without them, so it just feels odd to me. Um, but, yeah. Many coaches are trying to wean me off these because they say my feet don't look as pointed. Um, but yeah, I just can't. I need them on my feet. Okay, essential deodorant. If you don't have one of them in your gym bag, gross. Um, okay, some new handguards. Fresh, still in the packets. And then, yeah, another pan before that's literally crumpled up. Barely even a spare, really. Body spray. Mm, this is Soul Cow and Co. I don't even know where I got that from. But it smells amazing. Beach Bliss Body Mist. And it's coconut and vanilla. Everyone says when I spray this in the gym, it smells like holiday. So that, that's why I have it, because it brings back good memories. Um, <laughs> another pair of shorts. Um, this is my gym diary which I use sometimes, I mainly track, I don't know, some sessions like kind of track my injuries, so like I'll put in there like uh, normally like my back and my ankles and then if anything else flies up like a shoulder then I'll just jot it down on the day that it does and on the front of it says work like a boss because that's what I like to do in the gym and it's from House of CV, this one, a bit bougie. Um, but yeah, we love that. Now, everyone's gonna ask me what this is. This is for, ever since I 
just want to get a new pair of hand gloves. I'm sure many people will feel the same. The finger holes are really small and it's really hard to like actually like stretch them. Like most people like I used to like hook it on a bit of wire and just like literally tug it. This is so much easier. You literally just put it through the hole and then you can literally make it as big as you need to, which is great. Essential hairbrush. What else? <laughs> More essentials. This just needs to be in your gym bag now because of COVID-19. Antibacterial wipes and dental spray. I actually do keep these in my gym bag because you need to be cleaning the kit just after every time you use it so no one catches COVID. What else do we have in here? We have some spin socks when I used to do spins on the floor. They're always handy to keep just in case anyone wants to try some spins today. This is an essential for me on vault. I always use honey when I'm doing vault. Um, I think it was because mainly when I started doing my Cheng vault, the half on, I used to find that when I hit too hard, my hands would just slip. And even if like I had chalk on. So I always noticed the boys use honey a lot. Um, so I thought I'd try it. And now that stays in my gym bag as well. What else? In the um, Calf guards. Just in case I ever have sore calves. Love these cute little night ones. Okay, now what have we got in the sides? So we have some beats. I mean, I have a million pairs of headphones now, it's just silly. Got my over ear ones, which they look really cool, but I actually, I use them sometimes, but I, they make my ears really sweaty. So um, I don't use them too often. I also have these just spare ones. They clip on the side of my bag. Always need headphones in the gym. And then, what do you have on the side of here? Another body spray, a Vaseline, and some tape. And then this side, this is like the snack side. So I have two coffee sachets, just, you know, in case you ever get halfway through a session, you're absolutely dying and need a coffee. Zero bar, okay, in case you're dying through the session, you need a coffee. Some more headphones. These are my kind of go-tos and my beats, and they like, hook around my ear, don't know if you can see that, but they just stay in really, really well. My Apple Watch and some body cream. Okay, now we're gonna go into the fruit pockets. And we have in the front, bam, bam, bam. I normally have um, my pulse roll massage gun in here, but I actually left it at the gym today. Um, but these, it's just a pack of the other attachments that you can put on it, which are good. And then we have two hair clips, always handy. A couple of hair bubbles as well. And then I have a little golf ball. I use this to roll out like underneath my feet which is always helpful. And then, last pocket. Okay, so, I have my inhaler. And funny story behind these, I literally found out I, found out I was asthmatic last year, because we went on our training camp to Japan in the summer, and then came back and I got really bad chest infection. But like, when I mean really bad, it like, was really bad. And, Basically, all the dots were around. I mean, this is a really normal kind of chest infection response. Like, you're really, really like short of breath. And then, long story short, I had some asthmatic tests and I'm asthmatic. But <laughs> I can't take it without the little space chamber thing, which I got told is for babies. But so, whenever I'm in the gym now, I just like kind of like ducking my bag on that. But yeah, that's my asthma for you. And then I have a little box. I think this has just got a few hair bubbles in. I've got a pen. I've got these Beat It shots. Oh my God, if anyone has ever had one of these. If you can take it without holding your nose, 
there's something wrong with it because it absolutely stinks. I don't want to open it and smell it because one, it will just make me gag and two, I don't want it to leak in my bag. But yeah, these are good for like, if you're on a really tired day or if you know you've got routines and you need a lot of stamina, it's supposed to like go to like your red, red blood vessels, uh, cells, red blood cells, and basically like allow more oxygen to get in, something like that. Um, so it just helps for like stamina and stuff and it's all informed sport tested. Um, but honestly, you don't want to be taking one of them. Like if I could live without them, I would live without them because they're disgusting. Um, that's it for this bag and just some Nurofen. You never know when you need that in the gym. Um, yeah, so that's it for in there. And then obviously I've got a nice big bag of Pangards. And everyone laughs at me for having this big bag of Pangards because I only use about one pair in there. Yep, these are my fresh pair in my pack. And then these are all multiple used Pangards. But you never know if you're on a competition floor. You, you need that bag next to you because your handguard snaps, you need to jump in another one at the ready. You don't want a fresh pair like that, you want an old pair. And then, just some tape. These are handguards are in now, they're a little bit worn out, could do with wearing in my new ones. And yeah, I'm not going to go through all that because it's just chalky and my house is clean and I don't want a chalky house. And then, lastly, is my... Program. almost forgot the name and this just has like the yearly planner at the front which obviously all of that went out the window this year um but yeah my programs in what times i train um yeah some old programs my conditioning my conditioner do like back stretches wobble board for my ankles um just yeah just some stuff core like arm work, basically like activation stuff really. Um, and I have some of the circuits that I do in here that I do, um, currently I'm doing them on a Friday morning, but I used to do them on a Monday morning at David Lloyd. Throwbacks, a little bit of motivation in my folder. Yeah, some more circuits. These are my, all my start values for last year's World Champs. Um, yeah, really just, yeah, some new stuff, some old stuff in there, but yeah, that is basically what's in my gym bag. I don't know what the coolest thing is in here, I don't know, maybe the multiple pairs of hand guards, um, but yeah, I do love my little workbook though, it's very cute, but yeah, that. That's it really, that is what is in my gym bag. Maybe fascinating to you guys, but it's just standard stuff to me. I do find it laughable though that I literally have to keep decking spray in my gym bag these days because the world is just a crazy, crazy place right now. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys like this video. Please don't forget to like and subscribe and comment down below if you want to see anything else. Um, yeah, I hope you all have an amazing weekend and enjoy what you saw in my gym bag. Bye guys!